all right welcome back mr tim's here so next day and last night i wanted to start kind of softening up some of this black stuff on the hood here and it is it is thick it's been sitting under pine trees or some of that georgia pollen i don't know but i i had a really rough time kind of getting it off and you can see actually it's getting down to the through the green here um, on the paint um, so uh, but uh, I'm, I'm gonna get the pressure washer out here and see if I can do some better work on it clean this up because uh, she's dirty so the pressure washer is getting it off but it there's still some kind of really deep seated dirt down there that I'm really not getting I don't know if I'm ever going to get it. I may have to sand it down when I paint it or, or just let it be. Um, but uh, let's see if I can get it, the rest of it cleaned up. All right, so got it pressure washed. A lot of this is just not going to come off. It's just, this stuff is, is so porous now in this, on this fiberglass that it's not going to clean up. So I'm not going to worry about it too much because I'm going to sand it a little bit eventually and paint it. And I'm going to leave it like that for a while, most likely. Um, and then, you know, the rest of this just kind of went through and just kind of sprayed everything out, cleaned everything up. So I'll start getting all this stuff, um, kind of unbolted and out and, uh, get a couple other little projects going on it. Rear end kind of cleaned up nice. I may paint it uh, all tan, at least these sides, just to make it look a little visibly, uh, visually more appealing, just to get a little paint on here, start working on some holes and stuff like that, but uh, cool. It was nice to uh, spray out the engine compartment, I already had closed that, but it was nice to get that clean, and so uh, as I'm working on it and looking at things down there. Um, I know what's uh, what I'm looking at. Look at these big uh, armor bolts that they had going through here for these plates. They just cut the ends of them off. I got to get a lot of those out. So now this stuff's all clean, I can kind of see what I'm working with and, and go from here. Thanks for watching, y'all.